Caitlin Jenner is with me now. Caitlin, welcome back to the show. It's always good to see you. I know you're a big golfer. Do you support the Saudi push? Mm -hmm. Uh, actually, I do uh, support Liv. Uh, why? Because Liv is a disrupt disruptor. Um, they're going to shake the system up. The PGA Tour has never been challenged at all. And, you know, Stuart, this is called capitalism. Uh, you know, or at least what we have left in capitalism. Um, the Saudi PIF is extraordinarily well funded. I mean, they have like almost a trillion dollars in assets. And for them, this is like pocket change. Um, they can support this program um, at Live Golf forever if they wanted to. So uh, it'll be interesting to see how it turns out. Not only, you know, I, as an athlete and uh, golfers, they don't want politics involved in, in, in golf. But uh, unfortunately, it is. It's not the Saudis that I think people are, are as upset with. It's, the other thing is, it's Trump. Yes. You know, Trump is hosting two events. Yeah. Anytime yeah. he does something, yeah, I mean, there's controversy involved. So, honestly, I think it's probably going to take five years, next five years, and the Saudis can fund this hmm. to have this thing work out. By the way, I just asked Brett Baer if he could still drive 300 yards. I seem I to remember asking you yeah, that I about know. a couple no. of weeks ago. Can you drive he 300? Uh, I used to be able to drive 300. Age has kept, up, kept up with me, and I've had a few changes. Um, although I still hit the ball, I still hit the ball about 280 yards on a good drive. Maybe a little tailwind. You're right, you're but my right game up. is actually pretty good right now. Well done, well done. I'm going to change the subject for a second. I've done a lot on golf this morning. Democrats right. are predicting that the governor of California, Gavin Newsom, will be on the ballot in 2024. Okay, you're a Republican. You're from California. Newsom is your governor. You think that if he ran for the presidency, he could win? Boy, I sure hope not. He started off in San Francisco, and really the decline of San Francisco started under Gavin Newsom, destroyed that city, and it's gone downhill ever since. Um, then he took on California and has destroyed California. Um, it's The economy's gone Companies are leaving. I mean, the list goes on and on and on. And I just don't think he can do, do it. I think he's the only candidate that they have right now. I mean, Kamala Harris, please. Um, she's totally destroyed herself. She has no credibility whatsoever. Um, Newsom, the reason he would run and could win is because he'll be extraordinarily well-funded. I mean, he's part of the Pelosi machine. He's related to the family. Um, uh, he's working right now to get more of a national public image. Um, mm. He's out raising money. He can raise money all over the place. So is he a credible candidate? Yeah, he is. Unfortunately, he's just not a good candidate. <laughs> well said. All right. I want your thoughts on uh, President Biden testing positive for COVID. Uh, he's vaxxed, boosted has everything involved. I mean, I don't know why we're still demanding that people get vaccinated with a vaccination that actually doesn't work. What's your thoughts on this? Honestly, it just shows you that all of this social distancing, masking, vaccinations, all that stuff, it just doesn't work. Here you have the most protected man in the country, the president of the United States, and he comes down with COVID. I hope for a speedy recovery. I hope he does well. He's also got age on his side, so I think that makes it a little bit more difficult. But right now, um, we have vaccines, uh, we have medications. We, I mean, I've gotten COVID and yeah. it was, I didn't even take anything. It was just like, take yeah. it easy for a few days and it went away. Yep, me too. Caitlin, it's always fun to have you on the show. Please don't be a stranger. Come back soon, okay, please. I'll always I'll always come back, Stuart. You got a deal. Caitlin Jenner, thank you very much indeed. See you.